John, victory this evening here in Chadwick's Factor Park over Carlo. How would you reflect on the game, first of all? Um, another good occasion, great crowd. Good to get the win. Um, it means we've gone four games unbeaten here so far through the league. But lots, lots that I wouldn't be entirely happy with the performance. Um, I think that the standards we have for ourselves and what we will be expecting from ourselves, um, we didn't reach those tonight. It was a, a tight game for a long way. I suppose the goal right at the end uh, made it a six-point cushion. But as you mentioned there, there was there was some things maybe that could have been improved on. I think we had 11 wides more than Carlo had, which uh, maybe made the game tighter for a long way than it should have been. Uh, to be fair, I, I thought in terms of possession and shots and, and uh, kickouts and so on, we dominated. Like It's fair to say we controlled the game, but we, um, we were sloppy at times. We didn't move the ball forward as quickly as we would like at times. And we'll be very honest about that as well. So it's not always a case that win equals good and loss equals bad. We were happy with how we performed at times in, in leash and we didn't get a win. Um, tonight, we certainly won't be happy with lots of that. But having said that, um, like it's great that we finish on a high here. And like I said, it was important to us that we start to create. Wexford Park has been somewhere that teams don't want to come to. Um, and, that, and like I said, that's, that's four unbeaten here this year. Um, and finish off in high, loads of kids, lots of good atmosphere. So um, tonight was a positive night, but in terms of, of what we're looking to get out of it, um, lots that we need to work on. And if you were to reflect on the league as a, as a group of seven games, then how, how would you reflect on it? Well, look, it, it's, um, it's really fine margins. Uh, we set out to get promotion. Um, two draws cost us, and, and that's it. We don't have any complaints. We were we were poor in Sligo, but and um, and Leash, we were there thereabouts. But uh, no complaints about that. Um, if we'd won our two games, we drew. We're promoted. Simple as that. So you're talking about one point in two games. Um, I think to answer the question, we have unearthed five or six more intercounty players that that we didn't have at the start of the league. Injuries have meant that lots of people have got lots of game time. And I think we go into the championship in, in a good, strong position in that there, like I said, there are five or six or seven lads who can now consider themselves proper inter-county players that couldn't have started the league. And uh, finally then, to mention about the championship in a, in a couple of weeks' time, we're playing Leash in the first round. All systems go for that, no doubt. Yeah, all systems go is, is exactly it. Um, it used to be the case that you finished your league campaign and, and then there was a down period before you started to build up for championship. Um, this day, two weeks, will be the night before we play Leash. So our championship preparation starts tomorrow morning. Um, and I think that that's why league form and a bit of momentum going into it is important. And I think that that's something else we'll take out of tonight. Well, congratulations on victory tonight and best of luck in the championship as it comes up in the next few weeks. Thanks very much, Peter.